Hello everyone and welcome back to the walkthrough. We must head over to the Awakening Wood once more because there's something that we need from there. And, you know, the other place doesn't really have any access to any other areas because we can't really cross the water. So, yeah. So, here we go. Awakening Wood Part 2. Yesterday was a long day, like an hour. <laughs> Good morning. The white Pikmin are lodged with the purple ones in my hull. The two types are sleeping well and do not quarrel. I have made them most comfortable. You can call the white Pikmin by standing in the light beneath me and pressing A. On a separate note, be wary of overworking yourselves. Taking a break can be courageous too. <laughs> to re retire early for the day, press start slash pause to access the radar screen, then press R. So, yeah, I think they teach you this because there's... Not all of much you can do on this day. Well, I, I mean, yeah, there is stuff that you can do on this day, but you might be tempted to end the day early, but I'm gonna try and make the most of it. Because, uh, yeah, I gotta, gotta maximize your Pikmin profits as well as profits for the company, and yeah. <laughs> anyway, let's go back through here, and come on, just, just get them out of the way, just right, yeah, there we go. <laughs> Just gonna leave them there. Ah, no berries. No berries. Why? They haven't grown back yet, that's why. I don't think I can get that Carmax until I get yellow Pikmin, so I'm just gonna pass it up until now. I mean, for now. And I'm gonna go back over here to this wall that I was working on in the last part and get the whites. Preferably just the way. Uh, there's a couple mixed in with the red, but I can separate them in a minute. Go, 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 Take down the remaining bit of that wall. And get the. That was it? That was all that was left from. Oh, jeez. <laughs> Something tells me it is possible to get. Uh, get the treasure from this side then, anyway. Um, as you can tell, this one's got eyes. So, yeah. Attack, 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 attack! Done. <laughs> and over here, this is what I wanted to get. The other half of the globe. Fascinating. This object is highly similar to the ones you found in the Valley of Repose. By examining this further, I may be able to exploit new planetary data. Alright, so we gotta take that bad boy back. However, you probably wanna uh, complete this bridge here first. Just because it's gonna be easier to complete the bridge with a ton of Pikmin at your disposal. Uh, while they're doing that, I'll show you this spot over here. We can't do anything over here by this yellow Wallywog, and... Yeah, because, you know, it's water, water, not good for Pikmin. Yeah. <laughs> well, at least not these types of Pikmin. Need the blues to cross the water, need yellows to get past electric fences and other electric obstacles. Uh, I'm gonna chuck a bunch of these over there, and I'm gonna chuck a bunch of purples on there, and yeah, a couple more reds. The reason why I'm dividing the team here is because I just wanna have other Pikmin to do other tasks here, and yeah. Uh, wait, actually, do I have some whites? On there, I don't. I shouldn't have whites on there. By the way, they're oriented. Okay, I just wanted to make sure because I need. Uh, oh no 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 no! I need whites for something else over here um, on this side. Oh, wait, oh, nine really? <laughs> okay, ten. Good. Go 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 go. Um, so I'll look around. There's something I'm looking for on top of these walls here, but I actually think it's further up. Um, past the wall on this side here. I'm gonna have to separate the Pikmin here. Let's get six... Oh, there's, there's a red in here. Get back there. I want the Pikmin here to take down this wall as well as the um, the poison pipes over there. So, yeah, I'm going to let them do that. And the other Pikmin I'm going to take over here because the berries just may very well be ready. Oh, no! No! It's a ravenous whisker pillar. They eat the berries. Get... Get off there! Get! Stop it! No! Stop eating that! <laughs> Dang you! Dang you! <laughs> and I like when they carry them back to the onion. They're still alive and they're wiggling around like that. <laughs> Dang it! I could have gotten more berries if it wasn't for them. Yar! Yar! I say, like a pirate. <laughs> Come on, everyone! Get up there! Get! Get the berries! Must multitask to the max! Yes! 
multitasking is good. Very good. And I left Olimar by the whites there because I'm going to have them do some other stuff. Uh, well, I have uh, Lu Louis. Uh, yeah, Louis. What am I saying? Uh, I was I like, thinking Louis wasn't the right name. I don't know. Maybe I'm thinking of Pikmin 3 or something like that. Anyway, let's not leave Pikmin over here like I did the other day. Okay. <laughs> Sound good. Uh, I'm going to go grab... Uh, actually, I should probably get these guys. Take it back a little bit faster. They're, they're pretty slow. They don't have all that many Pikmin onto it. But I knew they'd make it by the end of the day regardless. Obviously, I can't go through there without blue Pikmin. Because I can't drain the water without them. So I can't really do anything there. But when I do get blues, I'll be able to shorten the route back. Uh, for some other stuff. Geographic projection! This hemisphere also contains a hidden microchip. I will attempt to decrypt the stored data. Coding complete! As I surmise, this chip contains additional topographic data. That data has been inputted into my database. I shall name it the Survey Chart. Sweet! So now we have access to a new area. And also, 30% of the depth has been recovered. Sweet! But actually, that's not as important as 100% in the game. <laughs> um, hmm, how are these guys doing? Oh, jeez. This is, uh, it's gonna take a while, isn't it? <laughs> so I might as well go and breed up the Pikmin over on this side. Sounds like a good idea? I think so. Hey, hey, you guys. I can't really do stuff, yeah, when I'm holding other Pikmin. <laughs> I brought my other thumb over to grab the C-Stick if you're wondering how I did that. But I want to try that for kicks. Um, by the way, they'll always bring back Pikmin to the Red Onion, if I didn't mention that already. I mean, bring back enemies and stuff to the Red Onion. So, yeah. Uh, yeah, there's not really much that I can do over here at this moment in time until they knock down that wall, and until more berries grow, unless another ravenous whisker pillar appears. Ah! Dang berry-eating SLB. <laughs> um... Yeah, how is the progress going over on this side while I'm looking for stuff to do? Hmm, yeah, I really don't see anything to even battle around here, Arg. I mean, there's that guy up there, but I don't know. It's kind of kind of risky to get. Eh, well, that's nearly done. Alright, for berries! Gotta get berries! Because there's nothing else to do! <laughs> that's, that's, again, why the ship probably mentioned that. Um, little tutorial thing, because they're- oh, oh, yes, yes, they are! They are back! We can get more ultra-spicy sprays. Oh, 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 Olimar's done! Well, I should say the Pikmin are done over here. And, uh, yeah. Alright, now over here, we have a weight puzzle. I really don't like these things. Uh, <laughs> what you gotta do is you gotta throw Pikmin up to the ledge, then have, like, one Pikmin in your party to chuck over here, and weight yourself up to the other side. Yeah. It's, it's very, very time-consuming. And over here, there is a die, and I would very much... I need 15, really? So I'm, I'm one short. <sighs> Come on. Come on. <laughs> I, I kind of want to get them to knock off these berries first before I uh, do another... Uh, do a little trip here with Louie. And actually... Uh, I can leave Pikmin around here to do this task while I'm not around here with Louie. So, yeah, I guess that is probably what I should do, and then I'll take this little squad of Pikmin up here. Well, actually, maybe I'll take a little more, because there is another version of those berry plants. Uh, you know, the burgeoning spider warts over here. Uh, those purple ones that you might have seen up on the, uh, um, up on the right side. But you'll, you'll... I'll introduce you to them properly when I get to them. Um, first, I'm going to flop all these Pikmin up here, except for one red. Uh, 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 okay, and I'm going to do the same thing with Louie here. And poop. And I'm going to grab this one. And now I'll be able to flip places. There we go. And now I can finally grab this die there. <laughs> and over here is the purple berry plant. It has different properties. Uh, I'm gonna grab this Pikmin before I forget about it. And I'm gonna chuck it up there for Olimar to take over to this plant right here. And I'm gonna take Louie around the long way. 
I just didn't want to lose any uh, Pikmin along the way or anything like that. Speaking of losing Pikmin along the way, are there any scattered around here besides the berry area? Well, there's that one there, but I think it's carrying a berry back. So, yeah. The die is back. Well, it's not called a die, it's a chance totem. <laughs> Woo! Chance totem! Okay, I'm done. Oh, by the way, um... Uh, casino uh, regulated dies cannot have rounded edges like that. They must have very sharp corners and perfectly balanced sides. Well, perfect up to some sort of regulatory um, uh, uh, dimensions or something like that. I forgot the names of, of... I mean, I forgot the dimensions of them. But yeah. Astonishing! This purple berry contains an ultra bitter essence. It does not appear to have any monetary value, but I shall research potential uses for it. Bring me another specimen. That is exactly what the other Pikmin are doing. But, um, anyway, as I was saying about the die, just as a little fun fact for you, is that the, the, the dies that you would typically get, like, um, just at a typical store, would not be allowed at casinos, because they don't really have as random of a probability as one, um, would believe they have. Believe it or not. <laughs> Yeah, it's just a little fun fact that I know about gaming. I know a lot about games in general, because I love my games and more berries! More berries, yes! So yeah, I'm gonna keep I'm gonna keep breeding up the berries here. I should say gathering up the berries here, because there's really not all that much to do here on the day, and yeah, I would not recommend going to sunset when uh, there's so many berries that you have potential of getting. And did these just grow back? Sweet! <laughs> Then I get some up here, and I can throw some there, yep, 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 just gonna keep breeding those berries like a madman, I'm gonna leave Olimar's squad here. Um, yeah, I still can't really do anything with that gate, even from that side, which is unfortunate. Uh, I'm gonna throw some over there. But yeah, I found that little fact interesting about dyes, because I always thought that dyes uh, had a random probability, but apparently uh, science says otherwise, unless they have certain dimensions and weight. I'm talking a lot about dyes, aren't I? You know, dice. <laughs> Captain Alamar, I have completed my research on the purple berries you discovered. Behold the Ultra Bitter Spray! It's untested, but I believe it will be highly effective. Approaching and approach enemies and press up on the D-pad to spray them. When necessary, I can produce one bottle of spray from ten berries. Press start pause to contact me and confirm your berry cone. Look at, look at L on the radar screen. Yeah, it's just like the... Um, uh, the red ones, and that you go over here, check your account, and yeah, now there's a purple version over there, but, and for some reason, again, I don't get why, you get, uh, you get a spray after just two berries, <laughs> at least for the first spray, so yeah, uh, how are these coming back? Not coming back at all, how sad, it looks like I, oh wait, wait, we got some more here, <laughs> they just popped out of nowhere, how about these, nope, 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 Still gotta get those berries, gotta maximize our daily quota. Actually, I should get some more Pikmin over here to uh, check up to there to get berries even faster. Yeah, come on everyone. You've taken enough berries back, now you gotta take some more. <laughs> I mean, I should say, you've, you've, you've lollygagged around over there enough. Let's go and do some more work, that's what I meant to say. I don't know what the heck I was saying there. I'm, maybe I'm getting batty trying to get as many berries as I possibly can here. <laughs> Uh, by the way, there is a uh, drop-off spot here, so you can't exactly easily get back over here um, unless you do the whole weight puzzle thing again. So that's kind of sucky until you uh, are able to knock down the gate that I was talking about. So, yeah. Anyway, the day is nearly at a close here. It's going to be a uh, one-part day here instead of a two-part day like last time because the last part was an hour of me doing a lot of underground stuff. So, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, there really isn't... Oh, oh, pellets! Hello, pellets! You've grown back beautifully! I will take some of you guys back. And is there any berries scattered around here that... Nope, guess not. So you guys go back in my party. And I will leave I'll, or Louis to do whatever it is I can do that's left over here. Uh, how did those two get... Those two stragglers get left over there? Did I, like, leave them behind when I was attacking stuff or something? I don't know. I, I'm guessing so, but anyway, it's very much worth getting these sprays like I'm doing here. Like, I've got seven sprays here, which is sensational. <laughs> 
So, yeah. Oh, 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 we're gonna get some more sprays. Well, potentially, because I've only got, uh, I got five berries per realm there. I should say per flower here. So, yeah, I'm gonna leave these guys to uh, grab berries as they fall down, I suppose. The ultra bitter sprays are especially powerful because they can turn uh, enemies into stone if you spray them on them. Yeah, the red sprays by pressing down are for the Pikmin, powering them up. And purple sprays are to freeze enemies into rocks. It's incredibly handy. Like, really, really handy versus stuff. Do not underestimate the handiness of these sprays. So, maximize your sprays while you can here, because it's not going to be so easy to uh, uh, get sprays at later areas in the game. In fact, this is probably the easiest place in the game to get sprays. So, yeah. Oh, 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 oh. It's, it's bobbing. It's bobbing. Is it going to produce more berries? Maybe. Might be. Probably not. Well, anyway, I'm going to get these more, get these suckers back here. At least see if I can get those suckers back. Um, this is getting close to the end of the day, though, so I should probably start gathering up Le Pikmin. Yep, ten seconds to go. Well, it's actually not seconds, because these are clearly longer than an actual second, but yeah. <laughs> Okay, you got that back, you got that back, good, let's switch to Olimar, 81 plus 14 is 95, sweet. So that means everyone is accounted for, and that means this day is as good as done. Can I get everyone back in their onion in time? Just four kicks? Who knows? Let's find out. And... And now the purples, go, 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 everyone in. Everyone in before time runs out? Yeah, you just made it! Congratulations, you get nothing for your efforts. <laughs> this day is complete. Woo! Yeah, and there's quite literally nothing more that we can do at this moment in time. Unless there's some sort of sequence break that I don't know of. But even so, I wouldn't risk it because the, the next two underground areas require some yellows and I think blues too. So, yeah, it's just not, I'm not even going to bother with that. Anyway, the day is set up for future days because I got the walls and got the walls knocked down, bridges made, etc, etc. Got a bunch of sprays for future days as well, which is going to be really nice. Still haven't really had an opportunity to use the sprays because there hasn't been really any tough enemies to uh, deal with or anything like that. But yeah, that was a much more productive day than it looks here on the uh, uh, fun screen here. And... I, of course, bred up some Pikmin. You cannot get whites or purples, you know, by breeding them normally, like reds, yellows, or blues. You can only get them by trading off um, using the violets or ivory candy pop buds. So, yeah. Moving on, let's check our email. Ah, of course we've got some. Olimar, good work so far. I hereby promote you to Perennial Manager. <laughs> Press X to divide up your work and Y to delegate more to your subordinate leader. Hope all goes smoothly. Thank you. Thank you very much. And with that, I'm going to end off this day because the next day we are going off to a new area. So I hope you enjoyed. And I'll see you in the next part when we go to the Perplexing Pool.